My name is Tom Dr. Q Rossman. I've been doing trick shots now for uh, 26 years. Keep making the ball. I love trick shots. Uh, I have a series of over 500 shots. Some of my favorite shots are shots that have unique names like the two plus two for you shot. Uh, bridge over troubled table, which is a combination of a prop shot and a fancy shot. Uh, there's some of the shots called the Great Race Half Mass Eight. There it is. Did you see it? And then there's a lot of other novel shots. <laughs> if a shot goes in the first time, it's not always what I want it to be. I want to sometimes miss and perfect the miss in such a way that the cover line allows me to create humor to the audience. No, here's how you build a snowman. I like this one I invented here recently. How to build a snowman. Just like that. Just bring that in. That's called a snowman. See there? Snowman. I use things like cue sticks where I, I, I lay a bridge across the table with, which have like a bridge head on the end of it. Then I have, of course, the coin tricks. Uh, a lot of different fascinating little prop things. You have some rare footage. No one in the entire United States has this shot on video. It's not something you just do overnight. You have to learn it through probably 10 or 15 years of dedicated practice. My name is Chef Anton. I've been hustling pool since I was about nine years old. Normally it starts just with a very simple idea and then I just try to build on to it and make this shot as interesting and creative as I possibly can. This is the very first shot that I ever created. It's known as the drawbridge. I'm going to try to make all four balls in the side pocket in numerical order. I love to use uh, triangles, pool cues, decks of cards, glasses, uh, anything that I can get my hands on. To me, the more props that you use, the more interesting the shots become. Some of the tricks are, are quite simple, but the majority of them take a couple of years to really get it down to not only the shot working, but the presentation, which is the more difficult part of it. Balancing a stack of three round balls is impressive, but nothing compared to this. If this shot works, it's known as the skyscraper. You uh, place three balls on the table and then place a triangle on top of the three balls and then just keep building the tower up until it's eight, nine stories tall. And you try to knock one ball out before the whole thing comes crashing down. <laughs> Centrifugal force that uh, keeps it intact, but the gravity is also the same thing that makes it go down if you hit it wrong. You've seen the skyscraper. Now I'm going to show you the wrecking ball. Now the idea of this is to, is, to, is to take off the nose without hitting a jaw. This shot combines perfect angle, speed, backspin, and a volunteer who has no idea what to do. To make this ten times harder, Chef Anton will now attempt the same shot blindfolded. I had a guy say one time to me, there ought to be a law against anybody having that much fun at that game. And I, went, I told him several years later, there ought to be a law against somebody not having that much fun at the game. Oh yeah, I have a, a definite passion for what I do. I wouldn't change it for the world. My name is Chef Anton, and you're watching Over the Edge. My name is Tom Rossman. I'm known as Dr. Q, Doctor of Billiardology. Yeah! And you're watching Over the Edge. It's a nice shot. <laughs>